My dream was to play you know, professional football and I got to achieve that dream, but when I got injured, it was about a year and a half recovery while I was in a full arm cast for about six months and then a year and a half just recovering from that, sleeping on my sister's couch. And during that time, I really had no clue what I was gonna do next with my life. I didn't know what my dreams were anymore because my dreams were over. I didn't have really any skills or value to add to the world, at least I didn't think so. And the thing that got me off the couch was really the support system that I have. I had an incredible family that brought me in and allowed me to be kind of broken and down and out for a while and supported me during that time. But I also had the foresight to reach out to people that were inspiring to me. That support gave me the inspiration and the motivation to start moving forward. So the School of Greatness book covers the eight principles of greatness on how to take your life to the next level. That could be if you're an athlete in sports, getting to the next level. That could be in relationships. That could be starting a new career, building a business, wanting to support your community, improving your family life. Whatever it is that next level looks like to you, these are the eight principles on how to make it happen. There's three things that hold people back from creating miracles in their life. That's fear of failure is usually the biggest thing. People are afraid to fail and they don't want to fail. No one wants to feel like they're not enough. The second thing would be the fear of success. What do we do when we do achieve success? The responsibility, the weight, all the things that come with that is scary for a lot of people as well. And then the third thing that I hear a lot of people is really the fear of just looking bad, being away from their inner circle, their friends not accepting them anymore. And so that fear holds people back of failure, success, and looking bad. When we, as humans, do things that fill us up, that make our hearts sing, that give us the most joy, and we're able to make an income to fulfill our basic needs, pay our rent, our bills, support ourselves and our family, we create the most joy for ourselves, and that's a ripple effect around everyone that experiences us. We're happier, we take care of our health, we take care of our emotional health, we are nicer to people when walking down the street, when we feel like we can do what we love and make money around that. So for me, the vision is to create programs, education, content, whatever it may be, but I want the vision to come true.